Hey guys, we're here at the Jedi Knights Watch and we're going to go Funko browsing. We're gonna go and stop at this Target and then there's a GameStop here. Yeah. And there's also this uh, cool comic book store downtown. Yeah, called Free Toys. Yeah, that I guess has a lot of cool stuff. So come with us and let's see what we find. Oh, wow, geez. guys, look at this. So we are at Target here, and they have some turtles. Ooh. Oh, I might have to get that. Oh man, I got the foot. That's very surprising. So, the two pack of the foot soldiers. Got them nice. there. Collect them all. Would have been cool if we saw uh, Bebop and Rocksteady, I but. Know. Oh, and right there they got the Haunted Mansion. We got a Batman pole dancing. Not really sure <laughs> what that's all about. Um, Stranger Things. I got a Jon Snow that just cute, just like that. Aww. Got Jon Snow with his his dire wolf. Tim There's the Kool Aid, Aid Man. It's pretty cool. Hey. We got a bunch of. We got Star Wars, Ray, Stranger Things up here, Frozen. Ooh, some bombshells. Look at some vinyl yet. Haunted Mansion one's pretty cool. If I was into Haunted Mansion, I would definitely like that. Die Hard Pop with a shirt. Might have to get this. So his shirt is off, but then you get a shirt. It's probably his shirt. That's pretty sweet. We got the Jeffersons. Only a Target. <laughs> some people that know each other. <laughs> Ooh, the Green Goblin from End of the Spider-Verse. Wow. I didn't know that existed. Emily. Oh, Wonder Woman. 1984. Man, this Snoke. I don't think they can get rid of this guy. I've seen him on sale for five bucks. <laughs> and he's still around. I see Ray everywhere. We got a Yara Greyjoy back here. Well, Yara. We already have her, though. But Robbie doesn't. Battle Lovey. That's pretty cool. Oh, that is cool. I'm trying to add to the Stranger Things collection of mine. Got some yeah, mystery mini Stranger Things, too. Jay. I don't watch Modern Family, so I'm not too familiar with that. Lots of Ray. I don't know. It surprises me that these are $8.99 and then these little guys are $5.99. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Marvel Girl. That's cool. I'm not really seeing a whole lot that stands yeah. out, but the turtles is pretty sweet, so you know, very happy with that. Pokemon. Do you, would you like a Squirtle? Squirtle, Squirtle. I was too old to get into the Pokemon, so I don't know uh, anything about that. I was that. into Pokemon for a couple of years. So we were just uh, walking down on this end cap, and they have Doc Holliday from Tombstone exclusive for $8.99. Oh, look at this. And then... I just got this online. I could have bought it here. Yeah. Uh, but he looks nice. At least I get to take a look at him. Soon, Robbie. Should get him Friday. Has anybody ever played these Funko vs. strategy games? They really look pretty cool. I don't know if every single one is a different, like, strategy. <laughs> There's another one right here. Yeah, it's always fun looking at the board games here. Minecraft. All right, guys, so we are leaving Target. We're going to go ahead and head over to the GameStop. It looks like we're getting that here, and we'll catch you in a minute. So we just got out of Target, and we had a pretty good find, the uh, Foot Clan. I can't get Rob in there. Oh, hey, Mom. There he is. Um, so now we're going to head to GameStop, see what we can find here. Not really looking for anything in particular, just kind of seeing if uh, anything catches our eye. Actually, the uh, Black Canary, or not Black Canary, Black Widow stuff would be pretty cool. Yeah. See you in there. They got here. Ooh, lots of Star Wars. Ooh, I like this original Human Torch. Oh, right there. There you go. Guild Wars. Got the Super Skull. Pennywise. I don't remember who Connex was. Black Canary from Birds of Prey. She must not have had a big part because I do not remember her at all. Oh man. Yeah, I saw her at Target too. I don't. Mm. I don't know. Not a big fan of the new Star Wars. Yeah. Got the director oh. series there. Let's see. Christmas stuff is still going on. Yeah, I like Christmas. I don't really get that. Game of Thrones. Oh, there's that Thanos right there. Oh, yeah. We can't get rid of the Game of Thrones. 
right? No, oh, Knight Rider, cool. that's really cool. Look at that. That is pretty sweet. Jack Skellington, Jack's house, Alfred. This one's really cool. Got a little light comes on. Batman and Robin's pretty sweet. That old Fallen Angels. They got a lot of scenes, pop scenes. Oh, they have the, the cereal there. Oh, Gladiator. Hey, they got Gladiator. Oh, nice. That's pretty cool. I have the uh, exclusive with his helmet on. That's cool. I also have Backstreet Boys, Britney Spears, Cozy Logo. Speed Racer. Huh. That's pretty cool. BTS. I don't really listen to them, but you know, it's cool. 10 inch there. Oh, they got Milton for the office space. Oh, that's, that's cool. With his red stapler. That's pretty cool. Yeah, behind here, they got Get Out while he's sitting in the chair there. Big so Josh Baskin. Us the there. Yeah. Really he's got a dig. The water knock. Oh, that's cool. That is pretty cool. The box is a little dinged up. Oh, yeah. I don't want that now. But if you're <laughs> out of the box collector. Right. Well, there's a Luther from Umbrella Academy. That's actually pretty cool. I like him. Ah, a little dinged up there on the corner. We'll see. Maybe I'll grab it. Onward. It's pretty sweet. Got some decent ones. I'm not seeing anything that I hey, know uh, I want to. these trolls ones. Oh yeah, she would. Back up there. Oh, here's some Black Widow ones. Oh, have, okay. Pretty sweet. Do they have Xena, Warrior Princess, Funko Pops. I mean, come on, really? I have never. But they don't have that '70s show. <laughs> We're gonna see what else they got around here in the store, and then see if we check out anything. I might go back to those Black Canary Pops. Or Black Canary, Black Widow Pops. I keep saying Canary. Here's some more Star Wars. And, all right, we'll let you know what we get. Just found Theon. Theon Greyjoy. Five bucks. She's probably gotta buy that one. Wow, look at his face, he's so happy. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys, what else do we got here? You know, some of these cool little action figures are pretty sweet. I've been um, turning some Funko <laughs> Pop cases on their sides and putting those smaller action figures in there. Yeah. Han Solo. That comes off pretty easy. Yeah. Oh, look at this, a little Yoda mask. I'm a big Kingdom Hearts fan, so. Oh, we got a lot of people in here now. Let's see. I really wish we didn't miss out on those 1990 Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Let's see what we got here. Oh, that Batman is really sweet. Here's a nice find. We have Shredder. From the 1990 movie. Sure. That's really cool. 25 bucks, it's not bad. Might have to get that one. <laughs> Maybe not, let's we'll see. Well, that turtle's down there, you said it was like 100 bucks? 40 bucks. Oh, 40. <laughs> it's like, dang. <laughs> sure. Wonder Woman. She's very ripped. On the road again. That's where we're going on the road again. So next we're going to Freak Toys, which is in downtown Chivagas. Chivagas! Actually known as Sheboygan up here in the north, the great north. Sheboygan! Uh, it's been a good day so far. Rob got a pop, I got some NECA toys. And this place, from what I've heard, is pretty legit. So, here we go. All right, so funny story is uh, we had a U-Haul because we were we were working and it's before we got all our stuff done, but we're on our way back to take the U-Haul back and we're stopping here. And this place is downtown Chevegas and everything is metered parking on the street. So we had to park about, what, five or six blocks away oh, yeah. at least? In front of somebody's house. Yeah, uh, yeah, we had to find some side streets. Um, so hopefully we're okay, but yeah, not easy trying to find parking with a U-Haul. <laughs> we were going to just buy a bunch of pops and, you know, shove them in the U-Haul, but 
because now we're gonna come with a lot of big bags and jump in the U-Haul and jet. But this is how dedicated we are. We wanna see what the store's all about because this place is about oh, 50 minutes from our house. So we want to make it worthwhile. I don't know when we'll be back. So yeah, we'll uh, check in when we get in. Right. Well, here we are. Look at these guys. You touch, you buy. Just remember that. Lots of comics. Tons of comics. Holy cow, this place is big. Got some wrestling stuff for all you WWE fans. Simpsons, that's pretty cool. Smithers. I got some loose figures for nine bucks. You ever see heroes? It's a good show. No. Man. Cool. All the new ish ones. Yeah. It's a little bit after my time. Right. Oh, wow, that's pretty cool. Oh, the, uh, oh, what's that called? Oh yeah, that's the uh, thing. Yeah, the thing. Yeah, we gotta brush up on fans. our skills here. Wow, like, yeah. here's all the pop wall. Oh, Mugatu. That's pretty cool. Oh, I got and Zoolander. That's cool. If you guys ever watched uh, Doug Funny. Oh, I watched Doug. Let's see what else they got. Crash Bandicoot. Oh, they got the mountain. The Walmart exclusive. I already have that, but... We got Topanga from Boy Meets World. What? Really? Yeah. That's funny. I got Georgie. Hello, Georgie. Oh, Power Rangers up top. Some good boxes, too. Yeah. Huh. Homer? That's cool. Oh, where is Moo Moo? I remember that one yeah. where he, he gains a bunch of weight so that he could just... Go on disability and still like work from home. Some Adam's family and some Star Wars Legos. Mm, this is cool. Yeah. It's funny. I don't have a scented pop. Like two bucks, I so. didn't even know they made scented pops. We've got some Star Wars here. Oh, lots of Star Wars. Ooh. What's oh, that? we got the office. <laughs> I'm in black. Andy Bernard. Pam Beasley. Pam Beasley, if you're nasty. <laughs> Seven bucks for Pam. That's a pretty good deal. Darth Vader. Yeah, I got that Vader. That's cool. He's a Luke. Thirteen bucks for the 2016 Galactic Convention. Oh, seriously, we got Tarkin. Oh, God. <laughs> I might okay. have to get Tarkin. How much is he? 13 bucks. Mm -hmm. We're gonna hold on to this guy. Loot Crate uh, exclusive here. It's hmm. pretty cool. General Leia. Some of the newer one. We got Thomas oh, Beckett from Solo. Bucks. We got really good prices here. Get Tarkin, sweet. Oh, this is pretty sweet. That's cool. Uh, First order. This is a specialty series that's pretty cool it looks like he's flying it's 11 bucks oh lots of good ones lots like of good ones reader, box is a little this is cool it's from the pilot oh yeah it's an old one too 15. i have the biker scout there's luke from half i like him Nightmare Before Christmas up there. Get some, looks like some Marvel ones down here. <laughs> Here's a Leia. Look at this Leia hiding here. It's 10 bucks. I've looked at this one on Amazon a bit. I never pulled the trigger. I would get her, but I think I like Tarkin better. That's cool, nice. right in all the Heartless. That's cool. That's really cool. I didn't know they had this. Some Batmans. Yeah, a lot of cool pops here. If anybody's in the West Wisconsin area, these are pretty sweet. Hey guys, so we are back from the pop 
hunt. That was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. We had a uh, lasted longer than I thought. We actually got to a few places. Kind of wish we would have picked up more, but I didn't want to go too crazy today because, well, you know. But we got a few good, good, uh, good deals, and we'd like to show it off to you real quick. And this poor guy, by the hour, is feeling worse <laughs> and worse. So if I uh, start sniffling, I do apologize. But uh, but the try to get show this. must go on. Yes. All right, so where did we stop first, Graham? Well, the first place we went was Target. Yep. Uh, I don't think you got anything. I did not. Uh, I almost got the Michael Jordan 10-inch pop, but I had already ordered it online a couple days before, uh, so I did not. Something that obviously you guys saw too was us walk right up to this beauty. Oh, yeah. Uh, the uh, NECA Teenage Mutant yep. Ninja Turtle Foot Clan 2-pack. Very excited about yeah. that. And if you guys haven't already seen our TMNT NECA uh, unboxing, then go ahead and check that out. This will go along very nicely with this collection. And we'll have to do that soon so that I can unbox this and play with these <laughs> toys too. <laughs> right. But yeah, no, I was really happy to find this. Um, I saw on Reddit and Facebook that there was some restocking of the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Classic Edition. So we, we thought it would be, you know, I don't think either of us thought we'd find any. Yeah. And we were like, whoa. Yeah, and uh, later on I guess we can talk about what else we found that sure. we did not get, but yeah. So very cool. They also had, as you guys saw, the Ninja Turtles as well, but we already, we already have those. Yeah. So. so then after that, where did we go? We went to GameStop, which was actually a couple stores down in that same parking lot. And yeah, we, we actually saw a lot of good stuff. I, I wanted to get all the Black Widow line. They only had three of them there. Black like, Widow or Black Canary? I know, right? I kept right. saying Black Canary. But I didn't. Uh, instead, I did, however, get Theon Greyjoy to add to my Game of Thrones line. Graham already has him. I have not picked him up yet. There is a little ding on the top of the box, but they all had a ding somewhere. So, But I had to pick him up. He was five bucks. Great to, to add to my collection. I haven't picked up a Game of Thrones pop in quite a while. And it's really amazing pop. So it really I was is. really happy that it took him so long to make a Theon pop. Yeah, man. And they really we did a good job. Yeah, we were talking about it for the longest time. Like, when's Theon coming? Yeah. You know? So, yeah. Five I, bucks. I'm, I mean, yeah, I'm, and I'm really happy with this pop. I, I couldn't pass it. I didn't get anything at GameStop. I saw the NECA. I was really into NECA yesterday. Yeah. Guess, but the, the 1990 Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, they had the Shredder there. But yeah. Yeah, he's was, not really what I'm looking for at this moment. I know online he's going for like 50 bucks. Yeah, and you're so trying it's a good deal, and but. you're trying to add more to the collection that you have right now, right? So. Yeah. So then we obviously ventured um, to our last destination, which was Freak Toys. Yeah. Down about Hunt, 10 Oregon. minutes down the the road there, and huh? I, I think, think we this did. Guy, this guy almost got about every pop there. Yeah, I, I almost had every pop. I'm gonna get this one. No, put it back. I'm gonna get this one. I'm like, I checked out. I'm waiting for like 20 minutes. <laughs> just like walking around. I just don't know when like, I'm gonna be back there because we don't live in Sheboygan. We yeah. we live quite a ways away, and we didn't know when we, we would be back. So I was like, should I get this? Should I get this? And they had some pretty good deals there. Some some were kind of comparable to eBay. Some maybe a couple dollars more, but for the most part, they had pretty some good. good deals. And then they also had some, which we did not show on camera, uh, about 40 pops maybe behind the counter. Oh yeah. So yeah, really cool. They were the more expensive pops. I think they had like Michelangelo, the Foot, so, uh, Foot Clan. They had, what else did they have? They had Hook. Mm -hmm. uh, with the crocodile, um, uh, General Akbar, yeah, Smoky Bear. Yeah. So yeah, a lot of cool pops. I did get a few. Yeah. Well, let's see. Okay. First one I picked out was the Green Goblin. I am That's a cool. huge Spider-Man fan. This is the Walgreens exclusive, and I have been wanting this for quite a while actually. It, it does have a couple dings on it, but on the box, but not too bad. Got it for thirteen bucks. I think they all kind of had some shelves. Yeah. But I think from people handling them and right right they're, they've been sitting for a while they're not new pops yeah, most yeah. of them but I, I love the green goblin he's got his little pumpkin in his hand and I, i'm just yeah it's a cool. fan to put him as part of my marvel collection that i have this I, one's a good one I, this was a good one i also picked <laughs> up luke skywalker uh the hoth version uh he's from an earlier line of Star Wars. I was really excited to get him. <laughs> Don't adjust uh, your TV screen. I, I, I wanted yeah. I wanted a few Star Wars pops. I, I only chose one because at the end I'll show you the, the the bigger pop that I chose to get because I'm a huge fan. But but yeah I had to get I had to get Luke Skywalker <laughs> I had to get Luke Skywalker. I he has a bunch of Star Wars pops if you haven't already seen on our Instagram page or behind us. 
So I'm I'm playing catch up with that. I'm new to the Star Wars line. I I think pretty much I only have two or three of them. So yeah, continuing with this. And uh, on the way home, we we, we noticed <laughs> that the box. I think I nonchalantly said, "Yeah, I like it." I just you know kind of a yellow. Yeah, he noticed it. I was like, "Thanks for telling me. I didn't notice that." The more you get to know Rob, the more you get to know how paranoid he gets. So yeah. he's like, "I'm gonna I'm gonna lose it in a few I'm, minutes." I'm gonna for a little bit, he thought it was a fake. Yeah, oh yeah. For a while, I was like looking it up online, like, is this a fake? Is that why the 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 plastic protector is is yellow and it's, golding? And it's an old box. And I was it's like, good. the Funko looks different than the other box. And he's like, yeah, because it's older. Yeah. <laughs> like, okay. That's a good find. All right. And last but not least, I got Sora riding the Heartless Wave from Kingdom Hearts 3. Uh, this is a very cool line. I have not seen this pop in real life. Uh, ever so when I saw it there I had a few other pops in hand, but I had to pick this up uh, It was about 28 bucks, but a good price the box is actually in pretty good shape mm -hmm. And I'm a huge Kingdom Hearts fan. I know this guy Yeah, but uh, yeah, I I've been Kingdom Hearts fan since I was probably 12 years old So yeah, very I'm excited to open up this pop I would like to do an opening at some point or at least get it on our Instagram page and kind of play around a little sure. bit and make a cool photo but yeah Happy to have this one. This is my my favorite my favorite find from from yesterday. All right, and what else did you get, Graham? All right. As soon as I saw um, General Moff Tarkin, I had to get him, which I did. I followed through. Um, I didn't even know they had a Funko Pop of Tarkin, so I was pretty ecstatic about that. He was reasonably priced, not expensive. Um, so I don't know something about Tarkin. Like how his hands are behind his back, you know. He's very uh, intimidating, but yet doesn't have a huge part. But everybody yeah. loves the the character of Tarkin. So yeah, um, yeah, it's a Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty exclusive, and uh, yeah, I was happy to get this one. The box is in really good shape. It is very good shape. It's a newer pop, but yeah, um, still really good shape. So yeah. that was my first one. I did wind up getting the Princess Leia. Is it uh, Bausch? where she goes and saves Han Solo in Return of the Jedi, undercover. Yeah, cool. uh, you saw me pick it up and say that I've I've looked at this one online for a while and yeah. just couldn't pull the trigger. Well, I actually went back and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get it. Um, so I, I've been wanting this one. I do want the, the unmasked, yeah. the exclusive, but that's right. pretty expensive. Yeah. So maybe over time, we'll see. Uh, I had um, thought about possibly the Foot Clan Funko Pop, but I didn't really want to spend 40 bucks on a, right. on a Funko. And um, they had a Superman where it looked like he was kind of flying. I think he was from Justice League. Okay. But, you know, kind of been focusing more on Star yeah. Wars lately, so. I was really looking for the Supergirl from the TV show. I like that pop a lot. And anywhere online, you're looking at like 30 to 50 bucks from what I've seen. So I was trying to ho hopefully get a good deal there, but I, they didn't have it. Sure. It was, it was a lot of fun. We, yeah. we were in the car and we just... Had a good time driving through all Sheboygan pretty much, yeah. and we'd love to do it again and see what we come to find. I was surprised with how uh, positive the results were. Yeah. So. yeah, it was our first time filming in store. Okay, so it was a little. You know, we, we may have been a little bit more uh, soft spoken as well, yeah. so please just kind of bear with us. We'll get oh, better at it. Yeah. <laughs> like, hey, oh, they got this. Oh, yeah. But yeah, we'll get better at it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, hopefully you liked this video. Uh, if you did, please give us a thumbs up. That helps us out a lot. And subscribe. Be a part of the Jedi Knights Watch. And um, find us on Instagram. Rob does a really great job running Instagram for us. Graham does a really good job running Facebook for us. Yeah, I don't put up a whole lot. Yeah, well, you know, <laughs> maybe one day. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, be a part of, of our cool community. And yeah. uh, let us know what you think of this video. Comment below with which of these pops was your favorite. Yeah. And if we made a mistake by not getting some of the pops we were going to. Yeah. Yeah, maybe we should have. All right, guys. Well, until next time, we'll see you soon. See you soon.